Hi guys, welcome to my video. In today's video, we are going to review this random curl contraption that Instagram convinced me to buy. I saw this product on an Instagram ad. So yes, Instagram convinced me to buy it. To be fair, Instagram convinces me to buy almost everything I see on Instagram. This is supposed to curl your hair with a blow dryer. And when I unboxed this in my first mega haul, you guys said you wanted to see if it really works or not. So here we are creating a video review of this product. It came from China. It comes in different colors. The reason I selected purple is because my blow dryer is also purple. This is actually my dog's blow dryer because this is my old blow dryer, but I needed one that would fit in here. And my current blow dryer, which is down here in this drawer, is a Dyson and there's no way, I don't think there's any way. Yeah, there's no way to fit this on here because it doesn't have a normal shape of a blow dryer. So instead, we are going to use Candy's blow dryer, that is this blow dryer, while we try this out on our hair. Based on the video, you connect this to your blow dryer, you put some of your hair in it, and you might notice that my hair is more of like a burgundy color instead of red. We accidentally, when we tried to put the black in our hair, rinsed it off and it turned my red into like a dark burgundy color. Luckily it's overtone so it will wash out. I don't know if I like it or don't yet. I originally thought of having my hair as the bright red color that I've been having in my videos. Now we have this like wine color and burgundy is actually one of my favorite colors more than red is. The red and black mixed, that's the good thing about overtone, is you can mix two colors to get the exact shade that you want. So you could mix like red and blue and make a custom purple or purple and blue and make a more blue purple or whatever. So it is kind of fun because you can play around with it just by mixing the colors up. This mix up was not intentional though. So let's get this started and see if this thing works or not. I'm gonna play music so you don't have to hear this. It's honestly like starting to curl it, but I'm gonna add a little bit of moisture to my hair. I think part of the problem is that I already straightened my hair. So we're gonna put make it a little bit wet with my Prep Rally spray.
So overall, my review, I would say that it worked. Obviously, because this was pre-straightened, it had a lot harder time curling and also the ends stayed very straight. I just covered it in water so that it would be back to like a natural state, even though I did straighten it already with the blow dryer. And the curls were so much better on this side. So I think if you were to do it straight out of the shower, you'd probably get the best results. Either way, both sides are not the same as if you curled it with a curling wand. It's also not the same as if I let my hair naturally dry. Like this is not the style curl I would get if my hair naturally dried, so I don't think that it's doing that. I think it is actually causing it to do curls, but it curls very tightly. I do think this would be good for someone who has a daughter and their daughter wants to start curling her hair or is interested in curling her hair but she is not old enough to use a curling iron. I burnt myself on a curling iron I don't even know how many times when I was younger. Even in high school I burnt myself with a curling iron multiple times. I burnt myself with a straightener multiple times. As an adult I have also burned myself. So it is a tool where you don't have like that direct heat from the curling iron where if you touch it, you will give yourself a really severe burn. You're still using heat because you're using a blow dryer, but I definitely think that it's safer than using a curling iron. I don't know, it's more like a beachy, naturally more look of a curl. It's not really like the same curl that you would wear out that's like really structured that you do with a curling iron or curling wand. So it's not a replacement to that, but I do think that it gave both sides of my hair curl. Now, of course, I have naturally curly hair, so even when I use a curling iron or a curling wand, my curls stay a lot longer and they stay better. But some people with like really straight hair, it's very hard for them to get a curl and hold a curl. I don't have that problem, so you're looking at my hair, but just keep that in mind that if you have really, really stick straight hair, this might not even work for you at all. That is my review. I definitely think, I think I paid like $12 for it or $15 for it. It really wasn't that expensive. It's just kind of like an attachment. It definitely did what it said it was gonna do. I'm not gonna burn myself using that product, but I will, I will still probably burn myself using a curling iron. So I guess if I wanted to do it fast or if I had been drinking, and I wanted to curl my hair and I didn't trust myself because of the amount of wine glasses in my system, maybe then I would use it. But if I really was like, oh, I wanna go out tonight and I want my curls to look really great, this is not that. This is a little bit more of beachy curl and like wild curl, not structured whatsoever. That is it. That is my review of this bizarre Instagram product that I got. What do you think about it? Would you use this product? Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys next time. Bye!